Hello everyone, and welcome to my bold and beautiful channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Luna's Surprise Pregnancy But who is the father? The bold and the beautiful report that Luna Nozawa is about to be sentenced for all of her crimes, but some surprises may still be in store. What if Luna is expecting a surprise pregnancy? After all, Luna informed Steffi Forrester that she slept with Zen Forrester Dominguez on purpose, and that he was the greatest she'd ever had. This contradicts Luna's previous portrayal of herself as an innocent virgin with RJ Forrester. Luna appears to have far more expertise in the bedroom than she previously admitted. Luna experienced a pregnancy scare earlier this year, leading her to believe she was pregnant. It was a false scare, but what if Luna had been pregnant since then? Zend would obviously not be a viable father possibility, but there are other options. Luna may be pregnant with RJ's child, and use the situation to guilt trip him into aiding her. A baby shocker would make matters even more complicated, as RJ would not want his child to be delivered in prison. Could RJ get Luna some top-tier legal representation and try to get her off the hook, or at least put her in a mental facility? Another baby daddy candidate could be Paul Hollis Hollister, Hollis W. Chambers, as Luna appears to be genuinely distressed about having to kill him. What if Hollis and Luna had more than just a friendship, and she is now pregnant by him? Luna may try to pass the kid off as RJ's, leading to a shocking revelation about the genuine paternity later. However, Luna may have hooked up with someone else because this tale is filled with rewrites and new truths being revealed. If B&B wanted to portray this as a pregnancy tale, there are numerous options available. Whatever the case, Luna may be hoping that her possible child will be her ticket to freedom or, at the very least, a lesser sentence in a more comfortable facility. Perhaps a pregnancy finding will allow Luna to manipulate RJ and remain connected to the artwork. Our predictions point to some unexpected twists, so we'll keep you updated on any big news Luna may yet have in store. According to the bold and the beautiful teasers, Luna's illicit activities will have a significant impact on RJ in the meanwhile. Bill rejects Will's new girlfriend, and Luna's nightmare puts the protective father on edge. Will Spencer appears to be on the edge of a new romantic adventure on the bold and the beautiful, but he will undoubtedly face hurdles. The dynamics with Luna Nozawa may present substantial challenges to Will's love life, so let's look into what lies ahead. The bold and the beautiful Bill Spencer could go into protective overdrive. Bill Spencer is likely to become an extraordinarily careful father as a result of the upheaval surrounding Luna. He may actually go into protective mode. Bill initially saw Luna as a charming and naive girl, but he now realizes that he utterly underestimated her, and she fooled him along with everyone else. This discovery could cause huge trust concerns for Bill, especially if a captivating young woman enters Will's life. He may find himself questioning whether Will's new girlfriend is indeed as wonderful as she appears, similar to his previous misperception of Luna. It is not difficult to imagine Bill disregarding Will's love interest, potentially causing problems that do not exist. B&B may think his father is paranoid. Perhaps his mother is as well. Will may need to convince Bill that not every lady poses a threat or is untrustworthy, but Bill will likely remain concerned, believing his father is paranoid. Under the current circumstances, Katie Logan might also play the part of a passionately protective mother, and Will may believe she is paranoid as well. Luna's innocent face has successfully duped many people, making Bill and Katie skeptical of Will's romantic aspirations. This increased scrutiny is sure to anger Will, potentially leading him to rebel against his parents. He may strongly defend the female he chooses to date, claiming that his parents are unkind to her, and judging her unfairly before even getting to know her. Will is old enough to make his own decision in the bold and the beautiful. Will is obviously grown enough to make his own dating selections, but that won't stop Bill and Katie from seeking to influence them. This familial crisis could act as a spark for Bill and Katie to enhance their bond as they work their way back into romance. Regardless of the outcome, our BNB forecast suggests that Will will find love soon. Given the awful situation that R.J. Forrester, Joshua Hoffman, found himself in, Bill and Katie will want to make sure that will avoid similar difficulties. Upcoming spoilers indicate that the news about Will's girlfriend may cause issues, so keep a watch out for updates on how Katie and Bill react. Jack becomes Luna's attorney, 
and her real father promises to keep her out of jail? The bold and the beautiful teases that Luna Nozawa will need a strong counsel to defend her now that she has admitted to murdering two men, kidnapping her cousin's wife Steffi Forrester, and framing her mother for murder. We can think of the ideal attorney for Luna. Do you know someone who would be a natural fit for Lunatic? Keep reading to find out who is an obvious choice to represent this eccentric young lady. The bold and the beautiful Luna Nawaza is a troubled soul. Luna's family has turned against her after her reign of terror. Her uncle Jack Finnegan is a lawyer and would be a logical fit for her case. He was at I.L. Giardino the night of the first murder, thus his appearance could have signaled a larger involvement in the coming weeks. B&B. How to defend Luna Nawaza? But, even if Jack gets involved what is the defense for a cold-blooded killer who framed her mother? Luna was initially portrayed as a charming character, and Steffi described her as such. Let us face it. Luna is a nice character who was accidentally poisoned by Poppy's medications. Jack Finnegan's conflict of interest from the bold and the beautiful. If Jack only wanted to consult on Luna's case, he could locate a colleague who could defend wacky Luna. In either case, would Jack be willing to use an insanity defense for Luna? Luna has acted like a monster in real life, and who is to say she isn't influenced by a brain tumor? However, it is simple to demonstrate that Poppy Nozawa was a lousy parent, struggled with substance misuse, and appeared to sleep her way around town. If Brooke Forrester is the community mattress, then Poppy is the community bicycle. Who wouldn't be sorry for Luna? B&B, Luna Nawaz's next act. Luna is adept at regulating her emotions, so she may burst into tears and blame her mother for ruining her life. So what if she kissed Bill Spencer, the guy she assumed was her father? Why would Jack want to handle such a hard case? If he is Luna's father, he may have a solid reason. We know that Bill is not Luna's father, but we can't be certain that Tom Starr is either. Poppy believes in free love, and there could be ten potential baby daddies. Consider this scenario. What if Jack tested Luna's DNA years ago and discovered that he is her father? If that's the case, he will not allow Luna go to jail. The bold and the beautiful. Will Jack Finnegan fight for Luna Nawaza? Luna is an excellent actor who may be sent to a mental health clinic rather than a jail cell. There she could deceive the doctors into believing she was cured. It worked for killer Sheila Sharp so why not for Luna? What do you believe should happen to Luna? Bill's new reality. Steffi and Finn's bright side. The bold and the beautiful says that Hope Logan will vow to Brooke Logan that her affections for John Finn Finnegan are under control, but Brooke has already heard that. Brooke will not be convinced that Hope truly understands the dangers of interfering with Finn and Steffi Forrester's marriage. The Logan Forrester dispute is terrible enough without Hope laying unwanted kisses on Steffi's husband, so Brooke will warn her daughter of this. Of course, news of Steffi's kidnapping and Luna Nozawa's arrest will spread. Brooke may even use the scenario as a reminder that acts might have unintended effects, such as when Steffi's reaction to the kiss led her to leave town. That led to Steffi spying Luna's own lip lock with Bill Spencer, which caused a lot of doubt about Steffi's location. Hope did not intend for any of this to occur, but Brooke may point out that betrayals sometimes set terrible things in action. Other BNB spoilers state that Bill will require a sympathetic ear, which he will receive when he confides in Liam Spencer. Liam will be reeling from all of the Luna revelations, as she turned out to be a psychopath who held Steffi captive and perpetrated the I.L. Giardino killings. Furthermore, Luna fabricated the paternity test and framed Poppy Nozawa, so Liam will respond to all of her sins. Bill may believe that he should have acted on Luna's warning flags, but Liam may claim that he had no idea what she was capable of. Furthermore, Liam will realize how much Bill desired Luna to be his kind-hearted daughter. Bill will be dealing with a lot of difficult feelings about Luna and Poppy, so Liam will be a huge assistance. As Bill adjusts to his new reality, Liam will give some reassuring words. At the Cliff House, Steffi and Finn will continue to cherish precious moments together. The good news is that Finn and Steffi's love has grown even stronger as a result of the Luna catastrophe. Steffi, Finn, Kelly Spencer, and Hayes Forrester Finnegan will eventually spend time reading together as a family which will feel like a wonderful gift after Steffi's kidnapping nightmare. According to the bold and the beautiful Finn and Steffi will look to the future after all of their turbulence, so we'll give you predictions on how they'll go forward as a devoted pair. Fans of bold and the beautiful call Luna cold-blooded, 
for turning on her own mother. Poppy is due for a nasty awakening from someone she least expects, her daughter Luna. On Wednesday's episode of The Bold and the Beautiful, Luna went to see Poppy in prison after she was accused of killing both Tom Starr and Hollis. Katie questioned Bill on the day Poppy was arrested because she didn't believe Poppy was the lady he thought she was. Katie suspected that Poppy had her sisterly falsify the paternity test results to show that Bill was Luna's father. The police then entered with Tom's book bag, which contained not only the letter he wrote to Luna pretending to be her father, but also the drug that had killed Tom and Hollis. Luna broke the news that the test was incorrect, and that she and Bill had taken two more to ensure the findings were accurate. Poppy felt horrible that she couldn't be there for her daughter during these times. Poppy had no idea that her daughter was the murderer and the person who tampered with the paternity test in order to not only become closer to her mother's boyfriend, Bill, Don Diamant, but also to secure the life she always desired. Luna went to see her mother before meeting with the detective. He expected Luna to voice her belief that her mother was innocent, but she startled him by revealing that she had proof that Poppy was guilty. Viewers at home were astounded by how far Poppy had gone to establish that she had not committed the crime. One person on X, formerly known as Twitter, wrote, Bold and beautiful now Luna throws mommy under the bus. Ouch! A second user wrote, Hashtag bold and beautiful Luna just threw her mother under the bus now that's cold-blooded. A third person wrote, Luna really went to the cops with evidence against her mom. That's diabolical hashtag bold and beautiful. A fourth wrote, Oh boy Luna is telling Det Baker that her mom isn't innocent and that she can't cover for her, not about this. She, Luna is labeled diabolical. After revealing her own twisted mastermind plan, Luna Lisa Yamada, is not the innocent girl that many thought she was. On an episode of The Bold and the Beautiful, Luna explained to Steffi how she ensured the paternity test proved Bill was her father, and why she chose to murder both Tom Starr and Hollis. Luna ordered a paternity test from the dark web after noticing Bill's close relationship with her mother, Poppy, and wondering when they first met. Because the timeline seemed to fit, Luna kept bothering her mother, convincing her that Bill might be her father after all. Even though her aunt Lee administered the test, fortunately for Luna, it was the exact same one she ordered that was positive so she switched them. Bill was ready to make Luna a Spencer, which meant she'd be set for life in terms of finances, security, and care. Luna was mortified when she found out where Tom worked because she knew he wanted to tell her the truth, so she decided to take extreme measures. She admitted to Steffi that she knew Tom was her father after reading the letters she had been reading for years despite her mother's belief that Luna was unaware of them. She put a powdered substance into his blue energy drink before his performance, when Luna discovered that Hollis knew about Tom being her father and the letters he had written her. She couldn't risk him spilling the truth, so she placed the same powdered material in his coconut drink, where he slumped and Luna simply walked away as he died. Viewers at home described Luna as evil, crazy, and diabolical. One user on X, formerly known as Twitter, wrote, Luna is one sick, twisted, devilish, psychotic lunatic hashtag bold and beautiful. Another person wrote, Luna's a mastermind. A nasty one. OMG hashtag bold and beautiful. A third wrote, So Luna became a full-fledged psychopath because her mother was quick and slept around? She absolutely despises her mother hashtag bold and beautiful. Fans of the bold and the beautiful are baffled by Luna's malevolent prop and believe the show has lost the storyline. On the Monday, August 26th episode of The Bold and the Beautiful Steffi was in for a rude awakening after drinking a spike drink when confronting Luna. The drugs began to wear off as terrifyingly, Steffi woke up inside a cage. She was perplexed as to how and why someone would do this until she realized it was Luna who had trapped her. After catching Luna and Bill kissing and following Luna to her apartment to confront her, Steffi began to suspect that Luna may have orchestrated the deaths of Tom Starr and Hollis on her mother in order to have Bill all to herself. Fans of the show wondered where Luna got the cage and how it got to the apartment so quickly. The cage Steffi was trapped in reminded them of a cage that her brother, Thomas, 
had once been trapped in at Spencer Publications, which they found amusing. One person on X, formerly known as Twitter, wrote, Hashtag Bold and Beautiful has so thoroughly lost the plot, but Luna putting Steffi in a cage and using a drill to keep her in there is peak hilarity. Another person wrote, Okay, I'm trying to figure out where in the hell did Cuckoo Luna get a cage from. How convenient hashtag bold and beautiful. A third person wrote, Luna is absolutely insane. And where did she just keep a human-sized cage? Hashtag bold and beautiful. A fourth wrote, Maybe Finn is her father. And Jack was there to cover for it. And Justin? Perhaps he intended to exact revenge on Bill and allied with Luna. He confined Thomas in a cage two years ago. And now Luna has put Steffi in a cage. Hashtag bold and beautiful. Steffi regained her strength and began yelling at Luna while hitting the cage, realizing that Luna was the murderer, despite her refusal to admit it. Luna initially pretended to be innocent before admitting that she had been able to get away with the murders thus far, and would continue to do so as long as Steffi was unable to escape. Taylor and Ridge celebrate Steffi's rescue with boot bumping? The bold and the beautiful tease that Taylor Hayes and Rich Forrester have reason to celebrate now that their daughter Steffi Forrester has been rescued by He-Man husband John Finn Finnegan. Finn went Deadpool on a closed door and discovered Steffi trapped in the clutches of his savage relative Luna Nozawa. Prior to this, Steffi's parents were scared beyond belief and had flexed their contact list. No one had seen Steffi, and their anxiety was growing by the minute. The bold and the beautiful. Steffi returns home safely. Ridge and Taylor enjoy euphoria when they see their daughter. Could this unexpected surge of affection alter Brooke Logan's relationship with the hunky designer? It's possible. We realize this triangle has more mileage than Issa Seals, but soap operas never tire of revisiting old territory, and it appears like Tridge and Bridge are ready to do just that. BNB. Are you Team Tridge or Team Bridge? This week, the two exes gathered in Steffi's cliff house to find out what happened to her. Fear led to reassuring hugs, but that may change now that Steffi has been found. Is the bold and the beautiful Stridge heating up? Steffi was discovered by her superhero husband, who refused to believe his wife was not in danger. It turns out he was correct, as his wayward cousin Luna Nozawa locked Steffi up after she realized Luna was a double murderer. At this point, we're wondering how long it will be before Steffi discovers Finn's family DNA is tainted. Sheila Carter tried to kill her. And now Luna is attempting to extinguish her lights. Is Steffi truly secure in her relationship with Finn? BNB. What happens next on the LA based Sudzer? Steffi will have to make that decision, but in the meantime, she is so relieved to have been saved that she has little time to consider her in laws. And you thought Meghan Markle's in laws were terrifying. Tell us, BNB fans, do you think Taylor and Ridge will reunite? Or are you tired of hearing the same old Tridge and Bridge stories? Also let us know how you feel about Rebecca Budig as the new tailor.